American Crossroads is the brainchild of Karl Rove, one of the most reviled political operatives for his 40-year history of electoral dirty tricks, including conspiring with Florida Secretary of State Catherine Harris in 2000 to manipulate the Bush presidential election, and using dirty money from lobbyist Jack Abramoff to tamper with the 2002 re-election of Alabama Governor Don Siegelman. Now, American Crossroads in the U.S. Chamber of Commerce, groups secretly funded by a cabal of corporate barons opposed to any common sense regulation, health care reform, environmental protection, or financial accountability, have pumped millions of dollars into ads supporting Kentucky Senate candidate Rand Paul without any disclosure of who has paid for these ads. These groups plan to each spend at least $50 million this year to manipulate elections and buy politicians in a dozen states. Such massive amounts are made possible by Citizens United, a 2010 Supreme Court decision allowing unlimited corporate funding of elections. Stephen Law, chief counsel of the U.S. Chamber of Commerce and CEO of American Crossroads, is promising donors that he will not disclose their names or how their money is spent. But 87% of Americans across the political spectrum do not want corporations buying their elected officials. And now, the IRS is conducting an investigation into these shadowy operations. Rand, you have campaigned against corporations and the criminal lobbying class, yet American Crossroads in the Chamber are supporting you, which represent those very corporations and lobbyists. You have campaigned on honesty and accountability, yet you are embracing Karl Rove, who hides behind lawyers and refuses to answer questions about his involvement in political dirty tricks. Do the right thing, Rand. Tell Karl Rove to keep his dirty money and dirty politics out of Kentucky elections.